Hello guys, this is my Arcada cabinet and um, I quickly added uh, Panic Playdate uh, just for testing, it's just a fun project and um, now I can launch uh, my Waternet game for example which is not released yet and it will launch a launch script I made that launches the simulator and then puts it with alt enter in full screen and it also waits for uh, uh, input for the S key and then sends an alt F4 key so basically I can play the little games now so, and I can quit it and select another one obviously I can only play the games uh, I bought and also only the games without a crank without needing a crank for example a cranky bird can be played without a crank Only pressing the R button Normally you play this with a crank But yeah, I thought it was it would be fun if I added the uh, Playdate uh, simulator to my arcade cabinet, so just for fun. There are other games, the baseball game. Which one was it? Uh, I'm not sure which one it was, but it was a baseball game I had bought from the holiday bundle. But I don't know which one it was. Maybe it was this one. Yeah, this one is a nice platformer, and this one you can play also, I think, for uh, as much as I played for the moment, you can also play without, um, without the crank. No. And um, there's nothing special about it, uh, basically the simulator does everything. Um, the only thing it doesn't have is uh, keys, well, command line parameters to set the game, to launch the simulator full screen, so I had to do that with a little script. Allee. So yeah. Just for fun. Um, I don't know which others. I know my Waternet game works, but there are a lot of games that are using the the crank. This one is also one without the crank. At least as far as I tested it. I haven't tested the other game modes. It's a very hard game. It goes okay in the beginning, but then when you miss a few, you're, you're, I don't know if you can jump, but you cannot pass the block anymore. This one is going fast. So for example, if this one, I cannot jump over it, I think. And then you're stuck on this side. And I think it's game over when, some, I think when a fish to touch, touches you, yeah. But eventually you get blocked and you cannot move. Um, I haven't tried, but I know this one requires probably a crank. Unless I can set it in the options to not use it. <coughs> Let me see. I thought that was an option. Oh yeah, auto doors. So 
So it's a nice 3D dungeon crawler. Oh, I think I went outside. I don't know. Yeah. What's the action for the sword? I'm not sure. I haven't really played this one. Well, let me see if I can find an enemy. I will probably die. There is one. I will just keep pressing the R button. So I died. So yeah, it's fun. I obviously I didn't have any um, screenshots or so yet. But I just wanted to see if it was possible. So yeah, that was it guys. Bye.